والله يدعو الى دار السلام ويهدي من يشاء الى صراط مستقيم look we had another brother muhammad from the kingdom of saudi arabia sheikh and he asked a question uh, really about muslim dress he says he works in a dawa center and a community dawa center at two um, many of the people who work there are saying to him that the Muslim uh, has a certain dress and thus wearing a suit or wearing a necktie and so forth is actually resembling the non-believers, not the Muslims, and thus you should not wear this kind of clothing. Uh, can you give us some advice on this, Sheikh? Well, that will be true if the dress code that the Muslim adopts is specific for certain kind of people who are known of their disbelief or their wickedness. Mm -hmm. But... Whenever this dress code is common amongst Muslims and non-Muslims, then there is no prohibition. We can say there is some sort of recommendation that the Prophet ﷺ used to wear the thawb, and he used to prefer the white, and he wears the imama, but it's not necessary. Whatever you wear and it covers the aura properly is permissible. Whatever you're wearing right now, Jamil, is perfectly fine. And there is no resemblance in that to the disbelievers, because this is a dress code that's common amongst Muslims and non-Muslims as well. So let's not confuse the issues there.